seriously wonder what rules are for if nobody actually respects them. We can't deny, the majority actually do stick to the rules. Negotiations are what the WTO is mainly about. What better place than to meet the boss at the negotiating table? Well, great choice of venue, by the way. Uh, the World Trade Organization is the place where countries come uh, to talk about trade, uh, negotiate trade, so new rules, new disciplines, and also keep an eye on each other's practices. That's a key point. They hold each other to account. We're not like referees that blow the whistle on a foul or something like that. You see, I sit up there at the presiding table, but it's the governments that run the show. And we, the WTO staff, are here to help them. By cooperating in the WTO, we ensure that economic tensions do not lead up to more serious confrontation. And this is why governments, right after the Second World War, negotiated trade rules, because they knew that economic cooperation is the key to peace and prosperity. Governments are members of the WTO, they own the organization. The WTO has big and small economies all under one roof. Everyone has a voice and a seat at the table. They agree on rules and principles, they figure out their differences and decide on the way forward. These rules create stability. That's what businesses need to thrive. That leads to jobs and growth. Yes, and the global economy is changing by the day, so the WTO has to evolve to, to help the members meet these challenges. Now you see, the trading system is like oxygen. While it's there, you don't notice. You take it for granted. But once you take it away, you will notice. That's true.